Hello everyone and welcome to a new YouTube series I've been planning to do for about a week now, let's say, uh, where I take a couple of my friends, let's say, <laughs> from the GeoGuessr community and I introduce them or in the case that they've had experience with it before, I'll just play a game with, with everyone who's nice enough to play with me of the co-op game mode. Uh, for those of you who um, have experience with the game mode, you can just skip to the next part. I'll maybe put a timestamp up there. Uh, but it's basically t uh, a two-player game mode where one player is in-game and the other player is on the map. And you have to communicate with each other and try to get to 5,000 points for both of you. You'll see how it works once we get in-game. And for this episode, for the first week, I've got uh, Chicago Geographer as a guest with me. Hello, how are you doing? Hey, I'm good. Thanks for having me. Yeah, thanks for joining me. And so um, <laughs> now you still get to, to make your choice. Do you want to start in-game or on the map? Uh, I'll, I'll start in-game, I guess. Okay, good. Uh, I've also got a timer running. Uh, we'll, we'll just play for fun mainly, but just so we know how quick we would have been and maybe to give Radox some feedback afterwards because he's the one who created the map for us. Thanks for that. And yeah, I'm ready when you are, basically. Okay, I'm ready to go. Okay, then three, two, one, go. Okay, we're starting uh, on a bridge over a river. We got yellow plates driving mm -hmm. right. Um, interesting. I'm going to head into, we got like a town sort of to the, to the west of us. I think we're in Colombia here. Mm-hmm. Uh, it says Casa de la Cultura, so some sort of museum or mm -hmm. something. Um, let's see. So uh, La Dorada, Medellin, and Mariquita are sort of to the north. There's a, a mm -hmm. roundabout here. Those are being pointed out to sort of in, to our north. Yeah, Medellin uh, is pretty obvious. What were the other two? Uh, it was uh, La Dorada, mm -hmm. uh, Medellin, and Mariquita. Okay. I'll see if I can find the other two somewhere. And then the center of this city is sort of to the south on the roundabout. Mm hmm I found La Dorada. It's a lot uh, smaller and it's next to a roundabout and next to a bridge. So that might even be where we were. Do you know? Okay. Do you remember if the bridge goes west, east or north, south? Uh, it's kind of slightly northwest, basically east, west, though. And it's a pretty, pretty large river here. Okay. Um, it was the, the roundabout, was that to the west or to the east of the bridge? Uh, to the west. Okay. Uh, still fits. <laughs> oh, I think, I think I just found the name of the town. I think it's called Honda. Okay. I, I just saw a sign. I'm looking. Uh, yeah. Looks like that's oh, the yeah, name I, of this I, place. I found Honda. Yep. Okay. That could fit. Uh, so if you could go back to the start here, uh, right. so we can just do some pinpointing and see if that's actually it. Uh, do you see any any street names, maybe? Uh, let me take a look. Uh, not exactly, not not near the start, but okay. I'll, I'll head further down and see. Uh, do you remember, like, was there a, a, a sort of monument in the roundabout? Uh, let's see. I don't think so, no. Okay. Oh, wait. Maybe there is. There's a a little sculpture, yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's sometimes <laughs> Some, difficult something. to tell. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah, uh, there, there might be something there. Okay. And I think we, we should be at the right place. Like, if you can maybe go back to the start and just head east. Sure, yeah. And you should hit a roundabout after, like, four or five side streets. Um, I don't actually see a roundabout here. The road starts curving to the south when I go east. Okay, there's, there's like two, uh, because the, the road splits up into two. There is one road that does curve south, but could you, like, regardless of whether there's street view coverage there, but could you go on to the east? Uh, yeah, sure. Just, like, keep heading, keep heading the, down the road, or? Yeah, go, go on, keep heading down the road. Okay. Yeah, so it curves south for a bit, then mm -hmm. starts going east again. Yeah. Are you still, like, next to the river? Um, not anymore, no. Okay. 
Uh, there's a, a, a mile marker or kilometer marker here. It says PR1. Is that? PR1. And also 5008. So maybe that's a hmm. number or something. Yeah, I mean, it is a number, but <laughs> well, yeah. pro probably not the number of the, the road we're on. Because, I mean, the, the right. one on, on Google Maps says 50. It looks 50. like a national road here. Um, but yeah, this, this road just sort of keeps heading east and south, curving around. Yeah, it it does fit. Um, and then also, I just went back to the start, so the, mm -hmm. there's like a some kind of church possibly, uh, just on the south end of this road going west. So like right after the bridge, there's some sort of larger building. Okay. Uh, yeah, there is a church on the map here. Uh, the, the markers on the map are a bit weird like some of them are right on the road uh, and some of them in the middle of nowhere uh, interesting uh, if you if you go to the roundabout to the west like that you were at the start okay and head north um, All right. and just follow that for a bit shouldn't take too long do you get sort of to to like a I don't know if it's an, an on ramp or something like that but to to a major um. road Actually, yeah, it does. It does look like that. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I think you can take out your map. Okay. And zoom into Colombia. Right. And go like just between Medellin and Bogota. Okay. Along that river, there's a town called Honda. All right. See it. And just on that bridge, I guess. Okay. All right. Yeah. So, at the it was like just sort of uh, lined up with the West Bank is the start. Okay. Yeah. So yeah, should right. be there. And at that point, I go into the game as well, place my marker there, and then I'm gonna count down and add zero or like three, two, one, go, and then we click on guess. Okay. Three, two, one, go. All right, yeah, where's the Got right it. one? All right, now awesome. I'm in game, and you're on the map. Okay. We are possibly in Austria <laughs> or <Okay>. in Switzerland. <laughs> like there, there's German here. All uh, right. I still have to figure out what sort of German-speaking country we're in. But Switzerland has low camera, right? Yes. So I, I don't think that's it. Okay. Uh, Kapfenberg is a city in Austria, in Styria. If you know okay. where that is. Uh, I'm actually not, <laughs> like not in, familiar with the, it. The most southern state in, in Austria, like southeast. southeast? Where, where Graz okay. is, basically. Okay. Uh, what was the name of the town? Kapfenberg. Kapfenberg, okay. Should be like relatively far north in that state, I think. I've been there before, but... <laughs> ah, I see it, yeah. Yeah. Okay. I think that's where we are. Uh, I saw right. like an ad for, for a festival or something like that. Uh, now, um, we start in front of a church to our south. Okay. And I think there's like... It's either a highway or it's train tracks to the east of us. Okay. Got to see if I can... Okay, it is train tracks. Um, to the to our east? Yeah. And we, okay. we pass the train tracks eventually. Like the road curves... Like the trail... Uh, the, the train tracks make a slight curve. And we, we go across them to the north. And there's also like a hospital here. Uh, so the road's going north? Yeah, it's just, it makes a slight curve. Uh, where we started, it's going sort of north, east, southwest. Uh, okay. But like relatively west, east ish. But I'm now uh, thinking about actually confirming that we're in that uh, town just to make sure. Yeah. Um,. So are, is the road we're on like a, a larger road or sort of like a, a side sta street? Starting road is relatively like residential area. Not, okay. not very big. Hmm. Uh, do you see any like train tracks? In yeah, there's the there's a couple train tracks passing through the city okay. here. Um, uh, to give you like a, a road name, you can look for Schmiedgasse. Schmiedgasse, okay. I don't know if that's... A, a big road that you can find but <laughs> it's it's a road here <laughs> all right and there's also a river running through it 
Yeah, there's yeah, I see that. Okay, yeah, we are north of the river. Okay. But not far north. Just like maybe two two side roads to the north. Okay. Um are there multiple bridges over the river? Uh yeah, there's one heading sort of northeast and then one that's more east west. Okay, the one I'm currently on is pretty north south actually. Ah, uh, okay. Um Hmm. Is that part of like a large highway? Cuz I see one no, that's more north south. It's a, it's a but... small one. Okay. Um, ah, I see. We might be... Uh, what did you say the name of the street was? Uh, <laughs> good question. Uh, <laughs> wait, let me, uh, Schmiedgasse, I think. Schmiedgasse, okay. Yeah. Because um, I see in the town just south of Kappenberg is Bruck an der Moor. Mm -hmm. and there's a north-south bridge here. Oh, uh, possible. Um, there's a sign here with two, uh, like national road sort of going off the the city with 20 and 116 okay yeah i see those okay so we're, def we're definitely around this area mm -hmm. and i think like the, the street name closest to us from where we came from is franz eiberstraße that's the okay. the biggest street close to us i think okay um Oh, I see that. Yeah, found that. Okay. Now I just got to remember how to get back there. Um, do you see, like, that? that's a bit north of us, I think, yeah. Okay. Wait, let me try this. Basically, when I, when I go just west of the church, there's, like, a road that goes south of there, and there's, like, a small, you know, for the bicycles to go over the bridge. That means like the river is directly south of us. Like there's just okay. one more road between us. I um, think I'm in the. I, I've narrowed it down to a few a few blocks here. Mm -hmm. um, and the actual the closest street to us, just a couple meters to the west, is called Reiserstraße. Uh, okay. Oh yeah, I see that too. Okay. Do you Excellent. see the the church at like the south end of that street? Uh yeah, is it on the on the west side of the street? Yes, it's like we are on on the side street of that, so we are on on a street going west east, north of the church. Okay. Is I see a street called Franz Eibelstrasse. Is that? Yeah, that should be a. Uh, I'm not a hundred percent sure where that is anymore. <laughs> I okay. should be a bit north of us, I think. But wait, let me go back and see if I can find the street name for the street we're actually on. None of these houses have it on them. Because um, I, I see there's the train tracks that are following this street. Mm -hmm. uh, is there uh, like one, uh, one side street that goes under the train tracks? Uh, yes. Yeah. And it right after it goes uh, goes under, going east, it curves to the north. Yes, that's definitely the one. And we okay, just just follow that street to the south, and you'll eventually hit the the street we've talked about before, the Reiserstraße or whatever it was. Yep. And we're just where those two streets meet up, like a bit to the to the east of that. Okay, it, it's like a T junction almost. Yeah, almost. Yeah. Okay. Uh, yeah. Okay. Got it. Okay. All right. Uh, I'm taking so the map. You ready? Mm hmm. Okay, so zoom into Austria. Mm hmm. Uh, zoom into Graz. Mm hmm. And then just to the north of it, you probably know where it yeah. is. <laughs> I'm, I'm zoomed in on it. Yep. Yep. <laughs> uh, so then you'll zoom into the, the river. You can sort of see mm -hmm. maybe a Hofer supermarket. Uh, uh, were, we, were we in Kapfenberg or Brook on the Moor? Which one? Uh, of the Kappenberg, okay, yeah. yeah, okay. Uh, uh, yeah, I can see the Hofer. Of, mm -hmm. Yep, sort of a fork in the river there, and you should see St. Oswald Church. I uh, think that's the one we started by. Oh, yeah, that one. Yeah, that it? could be it. it yeah, yeah, it, it, it is it. I think that's it, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. 
So now you've got to go into game as well. All right. Put your marker there. Okay. All right. Are you ready? Uh, yep, should be. Okay. Three, two, one, go. Nice. Got it. All right. Your turn again. Okay. So, oh, <laughs> wow. We, we're on Chicago Street. Uh, absolutely nowhere near Chicago. <laughs> <laughs> nice. That's fine. Uh, so we're at, at the intersection of Chicago and Station Street. Uh, okay. Looks like New Zealand, I think. New Zealand. Got a 03 area code on a truck, so. Okay, that's true. Oh, uh, yeah. Dunedin to Central Otago. Daily. So, oh, yeah, okay. New Zealand. South Island. Yeah. Um, there's a store here called Hinton Fruit and Wine Sales, so maybe that's <laughs> the place name. <laughs> I'll, I'll look for it. <laughs> All right. I'll, I'll try to find some better, <laughs> mm. better signs here. Uh, let's see. Yeah, it seems like a relatively decently sized town, I think. Does it look very beautiful, perhaps? Yes, absolutely. Okay. <laughs> I think I might have an idea. Okay. Let's see. Just trying to make it to a, a highway sign or something. Mm. Uh, yeah, I've made it to a more main street here. Uh, yeah, there's something. Okay, so we have the 85 and the 8 national highways. Uh, the 8 is going south from this town okay. uh, towards Roxburgh and Dunedin. There's the 85, there's the 8, okay. And then, yeah, on the 85 is Palmerston and Ranfurly. Mm -hmm. We could be in Alexandra. Okay. Uh, um, I'm going to see if I can find Chicago Street. Yeah, I'll go back to the start. So Chicago Street's going sort of northeast. Uh, mm -hmm. And then it ends in a T-junction with... Uh, <laughs> no idea how to pronounce this. N-G-A-P-A-R-A -A -A Street. Nyapara uh, okay. or something? Yep. <laughs> uh, I don't see them at the moment. Oh, no, I see Chicago Street. Yeah, and I see Ngapa Street. Okay, so then uh, Station Street is branching off to our south. Okay, yep, yeah, got it. Got it, okay. Mm -hmm. So you can zoom into New Zealand. All right. And like pretty far south on the southern island, um, like east of Queenstown, uh, there's, there's Cromwell and then there's Alexandra if you follow like the six right. and then the eight. Got it. And in Alexandra... You can maybe see the the gas station, the McKeon Alexandra Card Fuel, so uh, relatively yep, centrally. So yeah, and that's on Chicago Street. Okay. Yeah, got and it. And there's Station Street. Okay. All right. So I've got to put a marker down as well. Like if you were really really playing for time, you might just while I was basically explaining where we are, I might already switch over to to in game and already start zooming in while I'm explaining to you where it is, but we're not that try hard right now. <laughs> okay. So three, two, one, go. Nice. Okay. okay. Um, we're in Japan. <laughs> this, this could oh, be boy. fun. <laughs> <laughs> I've had some very, very long rounds in Japan. Um, to our east is Ato and to our west is Hagi. And we're alongside, you know, one of those two small, is it hexagonal roads or octagonal? I don't know. Yeah, something like that. Yeah. Um, so they okay. probably won't help you find anything. Uh, and to our, like, north east is Susa. Susa. Um, I haven't heard of any of those before. So. <laughs> yeah, me neither. <laughs> yeah. Okay, there's some kilometers. Ato is 36 kilometers away. And Mutsumi is 12 kilometers away. So Ato might be a bigger town. Okay. Is that a ATO or something yeah, like that? Yeah, ATO. Oh, okay. 
but like there's there's so many big japanese cities that i've never heard of so it might yeah. even might even be a big city uh and you said that's south of us or yes okay <laughs> <laughs> I, i think so uh actually wait no that that's north of us i think okay uh is there maybe like anything i could tell you in terms of like landscape that would help uh, you uh i guess does it look like hokkaido maybe <laughs> <laughs> um i can't really differentiate anything in japan okay so if, <laughs> if if you were asking me like is it mountainous yes but <laughs> okay so uh, yeah I'm, i'm not too good with japanese landscapes yeah. either so i haven't seen any cabbage around if that's <laughs> <laughs> that's what you're asking right. so yeah maybe maybe not a kind of then. yeah <laughs> uh, there's also a town called uh, Sasanami that's somewhere around here okay I'm basically just scanning the whole country yeah. now <laughs> okay yeah, Ato is definitely well it's at this point it's kind of to our east the road okay. curves quite a bit here I feel like with the signs I've seen so far, I should probably turn around and try the other way. Uh, see if there's any kilometer signs that way. Hopefully there are, because otherwise yeah. you're probably not going to get much more. Okay, that's the way I just went. Bad way. Uh, there's actually like, we start at sort of a T-junction, so there's three ways I can go. Okay. Hmm. Okay, Susa is 41 kilometers to our north, sort of. All right. Uh, how is that one spelled? S-U-S-A. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, it looks very rural here okay uh, there's also a tunnel to our, to our northeast hmm. uh, okay now I'll try the third way the one that's left <laughs> Doesn't really look much better, to be honest. <laughs> Maybe this one's easier for Radix to point, point, point for it, uh, <laughs> not for us. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Hagi is 10 kilometers. That's probably all that's that way. Okay. All right. Well, th at this point, I'm just still mm. scanning. Um. Unfortunately, can't read any Japanese either, so... <laughs> Even if there is like a prefecture name somewhere here, I'm probably not going to be able to read it. <laughs> uh, it's two kilometers to happiness, Fukue. <laughs> Whatever that means. <laughs> All right. <laughs> uh, I, I'm always so concerned that I, I've passed over it a hundred times scanning. <laughs> mm. Yeah, it's really hard. Like, if you don't know how big those cities are, at what sort of zoom level you should search. Yeah. I could uh, try and start looking for, like, a phone code. That could help. Yeah, maybe. I'm sort of out of, out of town again, so... Oh, I guess I'll just go to the next town. <laughs> And the, t the town we started in is Fukue. Fukue? Okay. Mm -hmm. There was a bus here that I was trying to look at and it just disappeared. Ah. <laughs> nope. Got teleported into the woods. Mm. All right, I'm going to 
to start a very, very zoomed in scan now. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, have you gone through the whole country otherwise? Uh, yeah, just about. Yeah, it shouldn't, like, realistically, it shouldn't be any of the, the small islands because you probably wouldn't have, like, 40 kilometer seas away from you. Yeah. Uh, Yamaguchi University of Human Welfare and Culture. Yamaguchi. Oh, that's a prefecture. I found that. Okay. Okay, good. So we're probably in there. Mm hmm. Uh. That at least uh, narrows down the search radius by a lot. <laughs> yeah. Ah, uh, I see Susa. Okay. Okay. Uh, so that's that's on the northern coast here of Japan. Okay. So mm -hmm. that's. Uh, which way did you say it was from us? I think that was northeast from us, but I'll have to go back to the sign. Uh, yeah, okay. that was forty-one kilometers. Uh, to the northeast at the point I am currently. I mean, could change depending on how okay. the road goes. Yeah. Uh, you might even be able to like look for the the, the road numbers now with uh, the the road number ten is going towards Susa. Okay, I see the ten. Mm hmm. Nice. And it, it uh, hits the 11 here. So basically, oh yeah. those two Got intersect. That. Yeah. I see Fukui Post Office too. Okay, nice. And we start off at pretty much the intersection with like the, the 10 and the 11. Okay. Got on, it. On the 11, still like maybe off, off center to the west of that intersection. Uh, on, the, on the 11? Yeah, on the 11. Okay. All right. Can I open my map? Yep. Okay. Uh, so zoom in to the sort of near Hiroshima, and you'll see Yamaguchi Prefecture to the west. Uh, oh, yeah, there it is. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, and then you'll see Hagi. Mm -hmm. We're just to the east of that. You should see the 10 and 11 there. There's the, yeah, there it is. Okay. Yep. All right. I'm ready. So whenever you are. Okay. Uh, three, two, one. Nice. Nice. All right. Mm hmm. Oops. Uh, last one looks like the U.S. I think. Okay. Uh, we have a two hundred nine area code. Not in Chicago, I assume. No. <laughs> <laughs> uh oh my gosh. Uh, we're <laughs> we're actually on another Chicago street. Uh, we're at Chicago and <laughs> Paradise. Uh, <laughs> All right. Very interesting. Bit of uh, a theme here. <laughs> uh, so yeah, we we're on Paradise, going northeast. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna look for more clues on the city. Seems like a California. Okay. City here. That that would be my guess. I'm just gonna zoom in randomly on Californian cities then. Oh, <laughs> uh, we have a bus here. Let's see. Uh, Modesto area, so we should be there. In the Central Valley. Um, can you explain? <laughs> uh, <laughs> it should be uh, in the middle, sort of north, not all the way to Sacramento, like okay. a little, little south of there. Mm -hmm. I just got very uh, distracted by apparently a town called ZZYZX <laughs> in California. What in the heck? Interesting. Interesting. <laughs> yeah. Uh, but yeah, we should be in Modesto. Oh, Modesto. Yeah, I see it. Okay. Yeah. Uh, I didn't quite to... quite uh, click for me that that's a city name. Oh, okay, gotcha. Uh, okay. Yeah, there's a. Uh... Suncrest Apartments next to us. Um, uh, what what then, is the the road direction of the the road you started on? Uh, it's we're on Paradise and it's mm -hmm. heading northeast southwest. Okay. There's also a salon and beauty supply and a McDonald's. Modesto is quite big for something I've never heard of. <laughs> yeah, this seems like a 
a relatively major street in the city. Mm -hmm. uh, I can see mountains to the southwest. That probably doesn't help much, though. <laughs> uh, yeah, doesn't really, doesn't really show me any mountains. Well, except far southwest, but that wouldn't narrow it down that much. Oh, got paradise. Okay. Uh, so where so is the Chicago? Chicago Street, sort of. Oh wait, are we? Oh, Chicago Avenue. I found yeah, that. Chicago Avenue. Okay. And that should branch off going sort of east from yep. Paradise. Mm -hmm. And are we right, right at that intersection? Uh, yeah, we're kind of just in the middle of this large intersection. There's like a lot of streets okay. and directions here. Yeah. yeah, you can take your map then. All right. Let's zoom into Modesto. <laughs> uh, Got east it. of. Okay, good. And on in the southeast part, like Paradise Road is the biggest road going off to the southwest. I mean, sorry. Okay. Yep. From got Modesto, it. and Chicago Avenue is sort of halfway between that and like the the South Carpenter Road. Okay. Oh uh, yeah, got it. Okay. Nice. And then I gotta go into the game. We just about took over thirty minutes. Oh. <laughs> Uh, there it is. Okay, three, two, one, go. Yeah, nice. All right. Thirty minutes and nine seconds. Hey, not bad. <laughs> mm -hmm. It was pretty good for a first time. Yeah, that that was actually a lot of fun. Um, yeah. Was, so, yeah. want to do another one? Ah, uh, sure. Let's do it. All right. Well, I'm gonna uh, thank everyone for watching this one. And if you want to see another episode of me playing cop with Chicago, go over to his channel and he'll upload his episode there. See ya.